Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Lord of the Rings Online. We are here at Roscobel with Radagast. Uh, we have a few things to go through before obviously the beginning of this episode. First off is uh, um, update 26 I think it is has now released which means uh, apparently two of our quests which I guess I'm gonna have to look up have uh, been removed from our quest log, which technically, I think from our quest log, or maybe just generally, um, have been removed due to versioning. That shouldn't affect us. If we hadn't done them, we probably weren't going to do them. Um, we also have the Tome of the Anniversary Celebration Pig, which we saw in the um, the uh, Legendary episode, but it's a really cool pig, uh, and it fires off fireworks. Uh, there we are. So I'm going to put him away for now. Um, don't want him distracting me. Uh, we also have uh, the celebration event, so we're actually going to go and finish that, get 167,000 experience. There is a chance I'm going to go around Chetwood or somewhere really, really low level and just kill a bunch of uh, really low enemies really, really quickly, uh, just because I want to try and get some steel tokens. I don't know, they do carry over. I've got 19 at the moment. I will potentially go into Bree and pick up a few uh, things, and uh, I'll probably do the anniversary event if I get the chance. Um, but I will do it with the term of the tor uh, stone of the tortoise on anyway, just to stop us actually, you know, um, getting anything, you know, uh, what am I trying to say? Stopping us getting experience. That's what I'm trying to say. Anyway, we also have our hobby gift of the day and the week. God, this is taking forever. <laughs> so our silver, I, I never get anything good for the silver. Please be something good for the gold. Improved legendary gift box. Oh my god. <laughs> You've received a gift from Gandalf. That is like, is that the highest I can get? Um, so that is a thousand virtue experience. Awesome. Uh, a stat tome box, which gets us a stat tome of our choice. Now, it'd be very interesting to see. Let's just, that is the best I've ever got. Um, let's just go put those on. Which means um, determination has now gone to level 45, is that? A little bit difficult to see. Yeah, 45. Um, we also have the 8-year gift box, which has some fireworks, but also this really cool cloak. Uh, it's kind of nice. I put that on on the legendary server, but I do like my whole uh, Yule Festival um, thing. It's kind of just become what I wear, so I'm just going to keep that for now. But I'm very interested in this. So I can choose... Okay, so if I use it, I choose what stat I want, and then from there I choose what tier I want, I guess. So we're going to obviously go for agility, I think, um, just to increase. Or should we go for fate? Interesting. Do we have any any previous ones that we can tear up? Oh, passive is where it'll be. Um, I don't think I've got any stats tomes already on here. Just double check. Uh, agility. No, okay. It's bound to account. Maybe I'll hold on to it. Maybe I'll use it on my main. I'm going to hold on before I work out exactly what I want. Probably a terrible idea, but if I can get, like, some cheap agility, you know, tier 1, tier 2s, then I can use that and get, like, a tier 3 agility so I get a nice bump up overall. Um, I will just have to do a little bit of looking into what I want. Anyway, for the birds, uh, let's go do that. We can repair birdhouses. This looks like just an easy quest to complete, so hopefully we don't have any issues there. Um... Just because I feel like I've been kind of lacking a little bit in terms of my quest completions. Um, just because we are kind of struggling a little bit. I think we did a lot better last episode using the new sort of, um, you know, actually using our skills for once. Because uh, I kind of get into this routine of literally barbed arrow, barrage shot, penetrating shot. Yeah. Um, which I kind of need to get out of that. I kind of fell back into it as well. Oh, there's someone here. I think, yeah, I see one over there. So we, we kind of did a bit better there, but also if I can get more agility, that'd be good. Um, but yeah, just one of those things that we can do. I'm really kind of buzzed about getting that 1,000 Virtue XP. That was really, really cool. I didn't even... Like, that is the first time I don't think I've ever, even with the old, um, like, Hobbit gifts and whatever, because it obviously used to be a little bit different. Um, it used to sort of kind of ro uh, roll through a, almost like a lottery sort of thing. Not lottery. Um, you know what I mean. Slot machine, that's kind of what I'm trying to think of. Um, I've never gotten, like, the top tier things. The best I got was, like, ma uh, the, you know, fine Madam Hunter stuff, uh, which obviously doesn't exist anymore. So, that's kind of cool. Hopefully we can use that properly. Is this going to be the one... No, there is apparently one down here. There it is. How many have we got? Seven, eight, two more to go. Um, okay, that's definitely more than ten. It should be good. 
I have a feeling I'm going to have to do something else with the birdhouses more than likely. But, I mean, if it's a quest that it's 120, so it, I think everything here is 120. Um, but if I can get like 160k XP for repairing some birdhouses, then I am all for that. I'm definitely up to do that whenever and wherever um, I can get that done. Um, that is also a point. I didn't do any uh, epic battles in between last episode and this episode uh, because it hasn't really been time to. But it is um, you know, still getting done occasionally, just not currently today. Um, so I also kind of felt a bit meh considering I got two, in, uh, two of the same thing in a row. Oh, that's a really easy quest completion then. Please be a decent amount of XP. It doesn't look like we're getting anything but gold marks for it, but... 318k? I will happily take 318k for repairing some birdhouses. Anyway, let's listen to the first fragment of the Tora Lindale. Assuming that's how you say it. Is that how I do it? Oh, no. I've got to go down here. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I kind of didn't pet it. I should probably put my wall steed on. I didn't really read that. I just kind of assumed I would have to talk to Radagast or listen to Radagast, but I guess not. That's kind of why I ended and or clicked on him because I thought it might be like a... Sometimes they give you a quest and then you've got to accept another instance or whatever to do it, but looks like that's not the case here. But that's fine. All right, let's head down here. Oh, not get bugged out. Let's try and... It's a little bit difficult when you can't really see the trees. Okay, it's a nice quiet place to stop and listen, just so I dismount there. Let's listen. You listen closely and hear part of a song. And you take the parchment of the section you heard. Nice. Nice. Uh, you write down the fragment of the song you hear. Oh, do I have to listen in the same place? No, I've got to go a little bit further up. That's alright, though. Oh. I wonder if we can listen whilst we're just in. <laughs> we write while we're in here. <laughs> I wonder. I might be able to get up on this little bank. Let's hope. Come on. There we are. Cool. Let's write it whilst we're in the water. Because it makes sense. Oh, no, we got to go quite far down. Part of me wishes the uh, river would just take me along. I could swim down it, but I think it's going to be just quicker overall. And we have been to here, yeah, Blongard, so um, that's also fine. Because if we need to then travel anywhere, maybe we've got to go talk to, well... Most likely we just go back to Radagast, but if we for some reason have to go anywhere else, we have a um, horse or stable master there. Oops, some spiders. Let's just get through there. Ideally without getting aggroed, but we already failed that. Let's just jump. I think we're just going to be better going in the water at this point. Because we're very, very close. And even though we're going to get uh, a hurt leg for a little bit, it's just going to probably work out better for us, I would have thought. So that's all good. We'll eventually get there. Soon-ish. Just wait for it. <laughs> uh, there we are. A lot quicker now. One of those things. Like sometimes you could do that and you'd have like a six second four. Sometimes it can be a 30 seconds, like just then, or sometimes it could be like 90 seconds. Nice, play, quiet place to stop and listen. Well, it's not a nice place, but it is quiet and we can listen. You listen closely and hear a part of the song. And I take the third part of the song. I wonder if we can. You write down the fragment of the song you hear. So we don't have any. We can't just use it. Oh, we've got to go bomb guard anyway. We'll go this way. I think it's just going to be quicker than that. And that also looks like it falls down. And uh, I'm not really wanting to do that. Also, there's a path here, so why not? And it's literally just here. Why not? 
Oh, this will be this will be right where um, we came through last time. That'll be or not last time, the time before. I'm kind of losing track of all my episodes, but that'll be where we were for uh, the what's its face, um, killing all the Gulladan. Or how are you supposed to say it? Uh. Don't hurt yourself. Oh, oh, very laggy. <laughs> War steeds, everybody. I can't get an episode without talking about them. <laughs> Alright, okay. He <laughs> just stop with the whole War Steed thing. But then that happens. It happens. And I'm just like. If I did that with a regular horse, it wouldn't happen. I don't really understand it. And I'm gonna go back. Oh, God. Arg. Okay. We'll we'll just wait and just slowly slowly do this. It'll take a bit. <laughs> Hopefully this is the last bit. Does it say how many? So we got introduction, refrain, bridge, conclusion. Okay, but if we've got the conclusion, then I don't know what order we did that in. Oh, the fifth. Yeah, it says the fifth fragment, but like, it doesn't say that like it's going to be the final. But if we've got the conclusion, it's like, are we doing it out of order most likely? Especially considering I, we probably got the finale there. Or the conclusion there. And I feel like this will be part five, but actually part four. Sort of thing. Or I could be just completely chatting rubbish. Ah, see, that was verse. Oh, listen for the final fragment. Aha, see? I was going to mention and be like, more than likely it would say final fragment rather than fifth fragment if that were the final one. Um, so, that's fine. At least we get a nice little quiet episode. We fix some birdhouses and we're listening to a nice song. And uh, so far, all we've done is hurt ourselves rather than hurt anybody else or uh, be attacked by anything else. We've been attacked, but I'm rude. Mm, it's we'll see. Um, but yeah. <laughs> right, let's just try and get through here without running into anything or getting hit or rubber banding too badly. This looks like the perfect place. Hey. Can't do that while mounted. Right, this is the final piece. We're probably going to have to go to Radagast after this, but... Luckily, we're very, very close to him, just over there. So right, uh, bring the song to Radagast and sing it to him. So instead of listening, we're now going to sing it to him. Because <laughs> I accidentally listened to him earlier. And he was just like, why are you listening to me? Just just go go do that thing. I've been waiting like a couple days for you to come back. Oh, while you're at it, fix my birdhouse. This is... I made it all the way there. So sing it. Radagast listens intently to the song you sing. What, what beautiful, beautiful song. Beautiful yes, I remember song. it now. There he said. Yes, I remember it now. The rivers and the streams shall cloud the minds of those who, who hate, but those who have kindness in the heart will always find their way. Examine the waters around Roscobel. So we have uh, two bits of water over here. So some shimmering waters and something over there. Yeah, there we go. Just examine these. The water shimmers. Who'd have thunk? Who'd have thunk it? Are we singing? The water shimmers. Well, that's good. So we sing the song. Those who hate. You have done much to aid my yeah. efforts. So of course it worked. You found you see the water shimmering. This true gift of the waters is a gift that will full hate and spread kindness throughout the forest. Oh, we got a singing pool of the Toraladane, Lindale. How do you say it? Uh, Goldmark's Steed XP, which, again, not really worth it. Very weird to still have Steed XP being rewarded. If you're at this point and you are not max speed Steed, I'm very confused. Um, I use it so little, I've still got a level 95 4 Steed somewhere. Um, actually, speaking of, where is my, like... Um, how do you do that? Is it Control-B? I want to find my mounted. Yeah, mounted combat. Still using level 95. 85. Christ, that's even worse. And my war steed is at max. Can I get a different war steed? Is that a thing? I don't know. 
Not really going to bother. I don't know why I'm getting distracted. I don't really care that much. So, that's done. We have done quest, quest of the Wilder Folk. A Beyonding's Tradition, Approach of Dawn, Goblins at War, Nightmare's End, and Saruman's Folly. We've completed A Song Amongst the Waters. So those are sort of different sub-quests, I guess. These are like the quest completions for the actual region, um, I guess. So it's very interesting. Um, so we need to go find out where these are and potentially go do those. What I'm going to do now is I'm just going to track by nearby because I don't know where to go. Uh, because we were struggling with that, but should we try ever so quickly, rush over there and just try to see if we can kill any extra enemies? It's not saying I'm going to complete it today, but I just want to see if with actually using our skills properly, we can, and actually having a bit better gear now, we can actually, you know, do what we need to do with uh, killing these guys. Because uh, I kind of want to get back on track with the epic quest. It's been a while. Obviously, I've done that entire side um, quest chain. Uh, so, and the other ones, like these 15 soul and supplies, more than likely it's just going to still be a little while before that's done. Um, same with the Hunger for Vengeance. These ones, if it's like a captain, it's probably going to be a bit of a pain. Travel to Vegbar. Now that is something else. I don't know where Vegbar is. Um. Where is that to, huh? In fact, let us quickly get all these quests off so that the only two quests we have are this massive one here and into the wolf dens. Oh, it's just up there. So maybe we should try and get to Vegbar instead. And then we'll do that as like, I don't know. I'm kind of like lost. We've done that side quest, but we're only like 17 minutes in. I kind of want to do one last thing before we end off. Um, so that we can actually like, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come over here and we're going to try and kill an enemy. I know I'm like all over the place, but I just want to see if it's possible. I'm not going to do the quest now. I'm going to say that just out off the bat. I'm not going to do the quest now. Um, we still have stuff that we can do, like get more um, stuff for our bow, because if I go to my bow, this, uh, this one, um, we have it there. We can actually get a max DPS of 866, which is actually our next tier. So I do need to try and do the you know, quests and ministries and stuff. I should probably do those possibly instead of the epic battles, just do my dailies and stuff and get the stuff I need to tear up this thing because, um, you know, that's where we're going to start lacking is we're very, very close, relatively, um, 80 uh, levels off from actually maxing that one out and considering that our DPS is actually going to be maxed in, that's going to be the issue. Obviously, we want to get our damage over time back up to 50 because um, that's what it previously was at. Um, we've also got an legacy slot open. I probably need to look into what the best sort of legacies are um, at the moment because I actually don't know what they are. Um, I don't need to worry about the ruffians, do I? Because you are not a half orc or an orc. Right, this dude. So 130k. I feel like that's very doable. I think it was some guys who were like 230k that was like my struggle. So we might actually be able to do this. I know I said I probably wouldn't, but it's definitely possible, I think, to... I think it's when I had two enemies on me. It's like one of those annoying things where it's like, I need to pick my battles, obviously. I don't want to aggro this glimmer. So I'm going to try it. Worst case scenario, we don't do well, especially since these guys are ranged. Worst case scenario, I just go and I um, uh, you know, a desperate flight out of here. 
I also haven't put my food on, so that's also uh, going for me well. And then we'll put blood arrow on you, so I can get the morale back. Get some nice damage over the time on you. And then, with having, obviously using blood arrows helping a lot. That works. In fact, we actually just leveled up our tier, so that actually means what I was chatting about just now. Um, our damage, our DPS, is currently at the max tier, which if, is actually kind of good in some regards. It's bad because we ideally want to be 67. If we can have 2,326.6 damage per second, that would be great compared to 870 or 866.6. Um, it's going to mean these are going to level up a little bit quicker as well, just because it's it's got less slots to go into. Um, until we get like an open legacy uh, or replace this legacy with something. Um, but again, I have to choose what I want. I could put like agility on there. I could put this so that we have a final tier of plus 264 agility. But at that point, I'd rather just get the tomes. So why not? Uh, but nonetheless, I think we learned some stuff today. I'm going to end off because uh, it's getting late into the episode. Um, we learned that we can do this. In fact, we might actually start with something like this with the lost spirit. Um, as well next time. So I'm going to head off quickly back to um, probably back to halt this. In fact, I've actually got the swift travel there, don't I? I'm going to head back here, repair all my stuff because I think it needs repairing, um, and then I'll do an epic battle, hopefully level up my uh, bow as well before next episode. I just don't want this episode to go on too long because I've been getting them up late because I've been sort of over recording um, because, you know, I'm being a bit stupid with it sometimes, but I think it'll be good. Uh, we can actually have a look at this sort of stuff yeah. because. Kizzy neck. Uh, well, I'm gonna tell you any like see on a beard item. So, yeah, I really need to get these embers of enchantment sorted. I really don't know the best way to do them, but like, obviously these are essences. But we can get like agility, and jewelry, and stuff uh, up to level. You know, you know. It's less jewelry. Jewelry we can just focus on doing epic battles to get. It's the armor. Um, we really need to get a 121 chess piece with better agility and vitality and fate. Probably fate's going to go down, but 283 fate, we can make that up somewhere else. Um, especially if we get better jewelry with it. for stuff that doesn't currently have fate, like this one. If we can get some fate on it, or this one. Um, fate increases will be great on those sort of things. Um, but yeah, we can get agility uh, on these... I just need to get embers of enchantment, uh, which means I need ember worthy crafts. So maybe while I'm editing and rendering this video, I'll just be doing some farming in the background um, with like the highest tier stuff, hoping that I can um, get that done. Probably not on this character because I haven't done anywhere near it, but I can do it on my uh, my actual farming character. Um, or maybe I can do it on here with the tomes done uh, or the stone of the torches on it, maybe. Anyway. I know we kind of left it off in the middle of the quest, but next episode we shall go back to that quest because I'm pretty confident now and hopefully I'll get some more stuff before then as well. Um, but that's going to be it for now. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.